Hello, Leo. How are you guys? To my subscribers, welcome back. To those of you who are new to my channel, welcome. Please don't be shy. Subscribe. Become part of our tribe. Okay? Always, always, always with good intention. We get it done, baby. We get it done. And so today we will be exploring uh, the Enchanted Map Oracles. They're beautiful cards. The pictures are beautiful. The drawings. Oh, excuse me. Um, we will be exploring <clears throat> the Enchanted Map Oracles by Colette Baron Reed. Yep. Trying to pinpoint where, uh, where in your life's journey you may be, Leo. Okay. We are about to go on an adventure to find out where you are, baby. Where you are. Where are you located in the map, in the enchanted map? In your life's journey. Spirit, ancestors, angel guides, you are welcome into the room for my subscribers of Leo. Tapping into the energy of my subscribers, my Leo subscribers. Then pointing where they may be in their life journey. We will be going uh, what has influenced you in the past. Uh, where you may be in the present, uh, what you may be resisting, right? Um, any unexpected help, uh, the next step needed, next step you may want to take, and then your future destination where you may be headed to so here we go spirit ancestors angel guides you are welcome into the room to give clear concise messages to my subscribers of leo here we go leo here we go here we go exploring the enchanted map I dropped too many, Leo. I dropped too many. Uh. <clears throat> Spirit, ancestors, angel guides, sending out clear messages to Leo. What they may need to know, what they may need to hear. Where they are in their life's journey. In the enchanted map, pinpointing locations in their past, what may have been influencing them in the past. For my subscribers of Leo, babies, it's tea time, babies, it's tea time. Don't forget to subscribe. I'm going to take that one because it flipped over in the deck. But over here, it was way too many. And we are starting with encouragement. Okay? So for some of you Leos, you may have had a parent that encouraged you to be a better you, to be a um, brighter you, to, um, to stand on your own two feet. Um, this parent influenced you in mm, 
encouragement. It could be a parent. It can be a, a family member. It could be a grandmother. It could be a grandfather. It can be uh, a teachers. It can be um, um, just peers that you look up to. No, it's a, a family member. <laughs> All right, spirit. Slow and steady. Slow and steady is the present point. At the present point, you... in the present. Slow and steady wins the race, baby. Slow and steady wins the race. Yep. Yep. Slow and steady. Um, when you go slow and steady, you can see the bigger picture. You can um, uh, shift directions. If you see something ahead of you is not uh, where you're trying to go. So slow and steady gets you there, baby. It gets you there. And then you have flying. Flying. Um, I was saying slow and steady gets you there. And that uh, slow and steady wins the race. And then you have flying. It what you may be resisting. And so... Um, to be honest, if you're going slow and steady and you are resisting going fast and and, and flying and 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 uh to be honest, I would go slow and steady. So you may be um on the right track mentally. As far as aligning your actions and your thoughts with what you're trying to achieve without rushing it, without, uh, like, uh, without creating a stampede, without, uh, hurting people in the progress, um, slow and steady, going with the flow towards what it is that you're trying to accomplish, towards what it is that um, may have you able to fly. <laughs> Hi. Uh, that's way too many. <coughs> Spirit, ancestors, angel guides, thank you. Uh, uh, rescue. Oh, this is beautiful. This looks like one of those, um, the fountain. It's like a fountain and the smoke comes out. I'm not quite sure what it's called, but a lot of people have them in their house. Um, so rescue. Um, So here, looks like they're flying out of a labyrinth, right? The labyrinth can be tricky. Um, you can get lost there. You can uh, end up in the dark and not find your way back out. Uh, the horse is full of beautiful colors. Uh, it, yes, it's a horse. The colors are wonderful. Um, the next card into your... Uh, that was what you was resisting. And then we have rescue in the... Uh, and what may help. So... So... It's making me feel like... I 
honestly, like, you don't need to be rescued. It really feels like you have your mind and you're going in the direction. In each card, you're going in the right direction. Look. You're the baby in this card. Because this is your past influence. What influenced you in the past? Which is an adult. A parent, a grandparent, a caretaker, right? And uh, it's going this way, right? He's facing that way. Slow and steady. It's facing that way. Flying. They're all facing in the same direction, which makes me feel like you are moving in the right direction. And you are slow and steady, keeping the pace to get you where you're going without um, creating too much chaos, without creating too much, uh, too much. And then you have rescue in your, um, like, like, uh, Um, like help, like unexpected help, right? Um, it can be you helping another, or it can be someone helping you, or it can be, um, spiritual, because it just makes me feel like that fountain that gives, that you meditate, the smoke, uh, it can be the divine, it can be the divine rescuing, rescuing you. Um, oh, wait. Oh, wait. <laughs> oh, there's a female in the hole. And, and there's a man in the air balloon. So, masculine may be rescuing the feminine. The feminine may need rescuing. Unexpected help. That's way too many. I'm glad they didn't fall on the floor because I wasn't trying to go all the way down here. <laughs> oh, and we have in the center, golden palace, baby, abundance. Abundance. Abundance is your next right action. I told you, you was going in the right direction, slow and steady. And, um, and, uh, and staying out of the labyrinth, staying out the way, right? Uh, the rescue. It could be you, it can be some, it can be you rescuing someone. It can be someone rescuing you. Maybe you need help in something. Uh, the feminine is the one being rescued. Um, oh. Um, so rescuing a feminine or you are, or you are the one needing to be rescued. The next action to take is abundance, a uh, golden palace. Moving to a golden palace. Um, living in luxury, maybe. Um, self, self built. Having your own, being prosperous. Next move. Uh, maybe investing into business or home or uh, some type of investment. 
some type of investment, some type of, it could be yours, it could be an inheritance, it could be um, something you want to buy, uh, we got two, we'll take them, we have uh, strength, strength, strength in your uh, future, in your future you have strength, number eight, infinity. Uh, number eight, success, um, power, because you got the golden palace, and then we is cleaning house, cleaning house in order to uh, make sure that everything within is correct. That you know we ain't got no creepy crawlers. There ain't no, um, nothing that is not for you, nothing that will, that might, um, cause some kind of chaos. Your, um, your structures are, um, this one is in the, in the sky, right? Maybe on a cliff or whatever. Um, I don't mean that literal, but I just mean that to say that sometimes people come into your life and they steal and they steal i'm not always materialistic things sometimes they come into your life and they destruct they they destroy your peace of mind uh your stability thank you spirit which is what i was looking for when i was trying to say they're both structures right Strong foundations, but um, it's easy to go over the cliff. And so you have cleaning house, cleaning out the clutter. Um, uh, getting rid of everything that ain't for you. You know you don't want to sit in stale energy. You want to keep it moving, baby. You want to keep it moving. So let's see. We got encouragement. Uh, 54 encouragement so you have you are receiving a nudge in the right direction <laughs> I just opened this deck and um and uh, in the rest, in the in the general reading, I was saying how we are going to go through this experience together because I haven't been through these cards. And I just want to let y'all know that because I'm going to read y'all Colette Baron Reed's interpretation of the cards. But first, I wanted to give y'all my perspective, right? And so. If I laugh it's, or something, I, it's not no disrespect to anyone. I am, I, sometimes I amaze myself, you know, but we don't make this shit up. It is what it is, right? Spirit is in the room, making sure we channeling what we're supposed to be channeling. And so I was telling y'all that y'all look like y'all are going in the right direction. And your first card out was encouragement. And the first thing that it says is, you are receiving a nudge in the right direction. Okay. Just pointing it out, baby. FYI. <laughs> this card tells you that you're being gently encouraged to step into your power, into the dream of your life. New things are out there to be explored and the nurturing power of the universe is giving you a nudge in the right direction. You will get the help you need and won't be alone in your quest. Every step you take right now is supported by the wisdom of the universe. You are on the right path. Keep going. And then we have slow and steady. Slow and steady, baby. Uh, 12. Yeah, 12. Slow, yeah. Uh, slow and steady wins the race. That is a common, um, a common saying. 
I'm not quite sure what culture it comes from, but I've heard it plenty of times. Remember the old cliche? Okay, it's a cliche. <laughs> Slow and steady wins the race. This is a time for easy movement, unhurried steps, and a steady heart. Trust that taking life at a more leisurely pace will give you greater success to your dreams. Slowing down allows more contact with the juicier elements of your life. Savor them. Yeah. Slow and steady, you get to see the horizon, baby. Okay. Flying. You have the power to see things from a higher perspective. If you were a bird flying high in the air, what would you see? When you soar above life's challenges and opportunities, a new perspective becomes available. Today you have invisible wings that allow you to swiftly bring your circumstances into alignment with your highest purpose. This is a sign that your waiting is over, that all your hard work has paid off and the things you hoped for are no longer beyond your scope. You have the ability to reach the stars and find one with your name on it. Spread your wings and soar. The angels are waiting for you. Awesome. So the divine got your back. It says spread your wings and soar, baby. Rise above. Remember I told you that's a labyrinth down there. Uh, 16. 16. You are always safe and secure and free to be yourself. Asking for help isn't easy for many successful people. However, that's what you need to do now as you expand your life. If you find yourself troubled, you can expect help with whatever issue is at hand now. You need only ask and assistance will come your way. The most important support you can expect is from spirit. Get into a right relationship with the divine and you'll see that many conditions line up as if by magic. To provide you with all the help you need, ask and you will receive. There is no need to fear. Safety is a place within. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. 23, Golden Palace. Golden Palace, there is always enough, amen. The Golden Palace card represents good fortune, ambitions fulfilled, wealth and prosperity. It may also indicate emotional fulfillment as perhaps you're entering a time of happiness that's long overdue. The message here is that self-worth isn't measured by what you have, no matter how abundant your life is. Instead, it comes from what you are, how authentically you've lived you're living your life and how much love you're willing to share. Granted, receiving this card does indicate material gain and the furthering of tangible rewards, but things come and go and knowing your true value leads to even greater riches now. Share the wealth. And then you have strength. And then you have strength. And that way you get my perspective and you get the perspective of the oracles, the book that came with the oracles from Colette Barron on where you may be in your life's journey, baby. Your true strength comes not from self-reliance alone, but from a sincere faith in the higher power. The strength to accomplish even the most daunting tasks is yours at this time. You can connect with and channel the power of the universe. The strength card indicates that your ideas are being tested and refined and your relationships are being deepened. No matter what happens, nothing can move you off the course of evolution as the, poten as the potency of your connections become more obvious. You're able to harness the creative energies that are available to you. Have courage and dive in, for magic is in the process of finding a form to take. When you remember that real strength comes from a combination of your efforts and reliance on a higher power working through you, all is possible. You can do anything now. Uh, outstanding. And number 37, cleaning house. Um, it's time to clear the clutter. 
to make way for better things. Mm -hmm. When you see the cleaning house card in a reading, it's time to declutter your life. Get rid of unwanted things in your physical home and release what no longer want what you no longer want or truly need. Is there any unfinished business you should address? Thoughts, memories, and emotional baggage must be swept out of your house as well. Your conscience must be clear for you to move freely in the world. Celebrate a spring cleaning and feel the freedom as you make way to for much better things. Look at what you're resisting. What look at what you've resisted, discarded, and be honest about its value. Be honest. Clean house. Be honest. Clean house. Okay, baby. And we are going to give you a daily affirmation. Daily affirmation for my Leos. The daily affirmation. Daily affirmation as we explore the enchanted map to see where Leo is at in his in their life's journey. I am always guided. I am always guided. I am always guided. Yep, and you are on the right path too. You are on the right path. Slow and steady wins the race, baby. And you have I breathe in love and exhale fear. I breathe in love and exhale fear. In with the good shit. Out with the bullshit. <laughs> okay, Leo. In with the good shit. Out with the bullshit. Here we go, baby. Here we go. One more daily affirmation for my subscribers of Leo. Please don't be shy. Please subscribe. Tell a friend to tell a friend. You know, Lee gonna bring you the tea, baby. Lee gonna bring you the tea. That was kind of me dropping shit. <laughs> uh, can we get one more for Leo? I don't think so, Leo. Oh, here we go. Uh, my goal is infinite and divine. My goal is infinite and divine. And we that's the only one we're going to keep, even though I dropped a whole bunch over here somewhere. Okay, we're going to give you a monthly moment for Leo, for my subscribers of Leo, the energy for my subscribers of Leo, monthly moment of inspiration for my Leo subscribers. Here we go. I don't know what the hell is going on. Is they backwards? Hold on, Leo. I think I just flipped this whole thing. Yep, sure it is. Okie dokie, here we go. Okay, monthly moment of inspiration for my Leos. For my Leos. What they may need to hear, to take with them on this path in their life's journey. Wake up and become awesome. Wake up and become awesome. Wake up and become awesome. Okay. And believe you can do it. Believe you can do it. Wake up and become awesome. Tell them you woke up like this, baby. Tell them you woke up like this. Yes, my soul is infinite and divine. I breathe in love and exhale fear. I am always guided. 
I am always guided. Uh, don't waste your time. And you only fail when you stop trying. Okay, babies. And we will give you a fortune cookie to take along the way. A fortune cookie for Leo to take along the way. And then I am out of here, babies. Here we go. Oh. Uh, assert yourself. Go for what you want. The time is ripe for soulmate connections. Birth of a child also likely. Woo! Assert yourself. Go for what you want. The time is ripe for soulmate connection and birth of a child also likely. For some of you, please let me know. I want to know Cinderella, Cinderella. <laughs> please like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell, hit all so that you may be notified when the tea is bubbling, baby. The sun is shining on you. Career and business growth Fabulous communication and relationships. Yes. Slow and steady, baby. It wins the race. Okay, Leo? So that was your tea, baby. That was your tea with Lee in your uh, exploring the enchanted maps of your life's journey. Awesome. Smooches, babies. Good night.